What's going on guys and welcome back to another park build. We are here on the Malta map because in today's video we are going to make an all Asia park. That means we're making a park with only creatures that lived in Asia. So first things first, we need to make the entrance. Let's have a arrival point like right here. And then what we'll do is um, make sure we have the amenities like we have an emergency shelter right over here. And we also have a, a bathroom right across from it. And we also have a hotel. And then what we will do is get the amenities ready. So let's work on that. We don't have any guests as of yet. And the first thing we need to do is build our first enclosure. So let's build a path right off the bat. Yeah, we're only using dinosaurs that lived in Asia. So we've got a path going here. Let's make our first enclosure. So what we could do is make like a small enclosure for Sinosauropteryx because that lived in Asia. So we'll make a very small enclosure, you know, not too small, but not too big either. We just want it big enough where they can roam around and do whatever. And since it's relatively small, we shouldn't have to worry about a um, another viewing dome. All right, let's get Sinosauropteryx in here. Get the small thing out of the way. All right, we've got Sinosauropteryx in the works. It'll be a relatively small enclosure. And then what we could do is maybe put an Oviraptor enclosure in another enclosure, like maybe right over here. We'll have like a small enclosure. All right, let's release the Sinosauropteryx. Our first dinosaur. And we'll probably split this into multiple parts as well. So don't worry. Alright, and let's get ourselves a feeder for the the Oviraptors. Along with a body of water. And maybe a small patch of forest. And the same for these guys. There we go. Make it look a little more lively. Alright, so we got the water, we got whatever. And we should probably put like a viewing dome like right over here. Alright, so let me go over the list of dinosaurs in that's gonna that, that are going to be in this park. Alright, so the dinosaurs in this park will be Archaeornithomimus, Chunkingosaurus, Crichtonsaurus, Dinochirus, Sungaripterus. Gallimimus, Gigantspinosaurus, Homalocephale, Huayungasaurus, Jehalopterus, Lystrosaurus, Mementisaurus, Monolophosaurus, Mosasaurus, Nothosaurus, Allura Titan, Oviraptor, Parasaurolophus, Plesiosaurus, Changosaurus, Sinoceratops, Sinosauropteryx, Therizinosaurus, Sintelosaurus, Velociraptor, Wuarosaurus, and Eutyrenus. So yeah, that's what we'll be throwing in, like, Dinosaurs that lived in Asia and dinosaurs that can be found in Asia will also live here. There we go. Oviraptor is in. We'll add ten dinosaurs this episode, and then we'll add ten more in the next episode. Alright, so let's get rid of this. Move this enclosure over to here for now, and then straighten this out and put this over here and we can add something else in here all right um we could add enclosures outside and we can also add enclosures inside so i think what we'll do is we'll put like um we'll make like a a large herbivore pen over here and maybe make it like a gyrosphere tour there we go all right so we got that done let's get a body of water like a big body of water, along with some vegetation. And then we'll move the hatchery over to here. And then I'm trying to think, what should we put in here? We'll put like four or five herbivores in here. So let me look at the list again, see how many um, things we have. We could put Archaeornithomimus in. 
or Chunkingosaurus. What about Archaeornithomimus, um, Crichtonsaurus, and Sino Sinoceratops, Parasaurolophus, and Mementisaurus? Or what about Sintausaurus? Yeah, we'll put that in. So, okay, so we got Archaeornithomimus. We'll throw that in. And then we can always add in more herbivores in, like, a separate enclosure. We could have a gyrosphere exhibit or something. Alright, Archaeonithomimus is ready to be hatched up, so we'll hatch that up. Start work on Crichtonsaurus as well. Sinoceratops. Sintausaurus. And finally, Mementisaurus. There we go. So we'll start off with Archaeonithomimus. Alright. The Archaeornithomimus is ready, so we'll release that first. Alright, what's next? We'll release the Crichtonsaurus next. I like watching the dinosaurs come out of their hatcheries. We'll save Mementisaurus for last. Let's release Sinoceratops next. Look at how tiny the Crichtonsaurus is compared to the Sinoceratops. That's too funny. Oh my god. Up next, Sinosintosaurus. Sorry. Last but not least, Mementisaurus. It'll probably be the biggest dinosaur in the park. And of course it has to be in the bushes, so I can't see a damn thing. <laughs> oh, that's a cool shot. That was a cool shot there. Alright, let's move this out of here, because that's that enclosure done. We'll let them explore their new home. We'll put in three more dinosaurs this episode. All right, let's put in a carnivore and maybe two pterosaurs this episode. So we'll have a concrete fence for the Changosaurus. That's what we'll throw in next. Don't throw in another enclosure or hatchery because we've already got one. We'll put it there. There we go. And a carnivore feeder. And a goat feeder as well. Carnivore and goat. Alright, let's throw in Changesaurus. Which will be in the queues right here. I never use this thing, so I don't know what it's like, you know? Alright, we get to check it out in this park. So this will be creature number eight. And then we can work on the aviary in the meantime. So I'm thinking we throw, like, an aviary in here, and this could have Sungaripterus and Jehalopterus. Oh, we can put in a viewing log here, so we'll put a viewing log here, and we'll put a viewing dome over here. And then, of course, we need a body of water. Let's decorate the aviary a little bit, make it more home-like. So we'll throw in, like, a patch of forest maybe over here. Along with some shrubbery. Let's get some random rocks. We'll just have like a bunch of rocks hanging around here. There we go. That'll be that done. Let's check on the Changosaurs. Throw that in. 5.3 million for four of them. Wow. Alright, we got some pterosaurs ready. Let's release them. While we wait for the Changosaurs. Alright, so that's Sungaripterus. And let's get Jehalopterus out as well. And of course, if there are more dinosaurs from Asia that come in a future DLC, I will be sure to add them in in the future. And let's release our last creature for the episode, Changosaurus. Let's go. So we have a carnivore anyway.
There we go. So this is our Jurassic World Asia so far. And so far it's coming along nicely. We have about 27, 28 dinosaurs altogether. So about 16, 17, 18 more to go. But yeah, I'm going to go work on those amenities off camera. And that's going to have to wrap it up for this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.